Okay. Hey everyone! My name is Nova. So I'm Judy. Hello. Welcome to Reaction Channel and today we are continuing with our Vikings Reactions Resident 3 of 10. The Dead, I believe was the name of the episode. <gasps> Before we start reactions, <laughs> uh, if you guys want the full length reactions or to get early access to like uh, Game of Thrones reactions or to vote in polls to determine which new shows or films we watch in the future, you can go check all that out on my ooh, Patreon link in the description box and in the comments down below. Alrighty, let's get into this. Where do we leave off? Ragnar was getting baptized. And he better not die. Yeah, we don't know if he's going to die or not. Um, but he's preparing to die. He is, because he wants to be with Athos then. Yeah, which and totally made him. Floki mad. Oh, Ooh. Well, and everyone else didn't look too pleased either. You know, like, um, like I said, she was kind of standing there, not looking too, out. yeah, not looking too happy. And... <laughs> yes. I know who he's renouncing their religion. And right. He, and he's like, I want to become a Christian so I can be with Athos then in the afterlife. But you know, it's quite romantic when you think about it. Right, but not <laughs> They're in their romance. But not in their eyes. No. Oof. Um, <clears throat> all right, and we thought was it this episode or was it the one before? What? Um, about the boar or did we realize that a previous episode? The boar. Oh Rolo. That it might be boar. No, it was this past episode. Boar. Yeah. Bear, excuse me. Bear. bear, I'm a bear. Um yeah, that Rolo might be the bear that either dies or marries open to Right. Me. And Bjorn might die and marry a princess. But the seer did say Bjorn will either marry a princess. So I don't or know. one of his other sons. Or, no, it was Bjorn will... No, Bjorn, no, they never said the other sons. Said, oh, that's true. That's true. Because he said... He, right. Because he gave a couple of things. Like either he could be sailing the world Forever, or... Forever, or he'll marry a princess. Right, 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 right. That's right. Whereas, yeah, Warlow has never been announced that he'll marry a princess. Right. Just that... But we know a bear will either be married a princess, or he'll be... Or a bear will be crowned by a princess. And, and who knows our what interpretation that means. of crown could be could mean be being killed. Beheaded. Your crown, your heads come right. off, or you get crown like you. Yep. Coronation. Yeah, we don't know. So I guess we'll see. Time will tell. Um. Yeah, an expert. Um. Experts. Was with Judith. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. May or may not know. And Eckbert was like. Maybe wanting out who left to die, maybe. Yeah. Because he was asking them point blank, and he's like denying it, which of course we know he lies. So. I know. I think that was it for the episode. <clears throat> yeah. No, there might have been more. Okay, I don't good. remember. That's good. Okay. He got all the gold. Oh, he doesn't look too good. <laughs> it's going to take a miracle for him to live. And besides, he needs to die in battle. Well, no, he doesn't want to go to Baha'u'llah. He wants to go to... He wants to go to heaven, never mind. And I want to be with Athelstan. <laughs> What's up, please do know. I want to see Athelstan again. <laughs> <clears throat> but then, but then Rolo's like, but I won't see you again when I die. Or anything. Bjorn won't see, see you again is. when he dies. Oh, okay, yeah. What <clears throat> Someone needs to kill him. Oh, Ragnar? Yeah, that's who they're talking about. It's like, dude, he's already dying. I know. Just let him die in peace. God bless you, daughter. God bless Paris. I love how judgy she is of her dad. <laughs> She's just thinking, like, I know I can do better. Yeah, I think that's why she wanted him out there fighting, so maybe he'd die and she could take over. Oh, maybe. What's Rolo thinking? If you would truly see what the gods have in store for you. You would go mm. down now and dance naked on the beach. I still don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I naturally assumed it was a bad thing because it was if he gets his head chopped off. <laughs> that's a bad thing. Well, if he gets to marry the princess. <laughs> no, that's a good thing. Then it's a happy. <coughs> <clears throat> yeah, I don't know what that thing by yeah. the seer meant. The prophecy. But then again, breaking her could be interesting. Ooh. Is there a way that... Is he gonna show, like, is he into kinky stuff or something? <laughs> <clears throat> it looks like chains. Yeah, so kinky stuff. <laughs> I'm guessing. If you would, submit. Yeah, kinky to stuff. <laughs> to being chained up and whipped. 
Of course, I will allow you to choose the whip. Oh my god. Some are more severe than others. Yikes. Did not expect him to be yeah. into this. Tell me what to strike. Oh. <laughs> Say strike. Are you squinting? Yeah. Okay, she's squinting, you guys. Turn up that I'm plugging here too. Okay. Okay, then. Sorry, I'm just not into that. Ragnar asked me to build him one last pot. His boy's gonna die on. I still can't believe they're gonna break their die. Huh, I hope he doesn't. I know. <laughs> I hope we get the last second. I go, wait, no, he's healed. He's magically healed. I never realized how small Bjorn's mouth is before. <laughs> Sorry. Random. He's so tiny. <laughs> Baby Bjorn, he's all scared. Well, he's going to have to become king when Ragnar dies. I'm assuming. Unless someone, like, fights him for it. Otherwise, he'd, I think, become king. Uh, yeah. Because Elander was going to become king after Horik died, so... But since Ragnar killed him, he became king. No, yeah, I know. That's what I meant. Yeah. I don't... But unless you but die like natural causes. Yeah. Oh, that's maybe why Erlander wants to kill him. So Erlander can try to become king. Maybe, yeah, I don't know. If it goes to Bjorn. Oh, yeah, if he goes Ragnar, then yeah, he'd become king. Because if Ragnar... Erlander wants to kill him. Yeah, if Ragnar dies to natural causes, then it would Bjorn. It goes to Bjorn. Yeah. We're assuming, yeah. Would yeah, who assume... else would it go to? But I'm sure anyone could fight him on it if they wanted. What? Is he dead? Is he? Do you see Bjorn? Yes! He's dead, just like that. We didn't even get to see his like last breast or whatever the heck? He's in there? I'm assuming. Well, I don't know. Now, Bjorn and him did hold hands. So either it's some sort of a trick, or he's really dead. Hmm. <gasps> or he's not dead and he wants to just get his way into the castle. Hmm. And there's like weapons in there. Hmm. Like there's weapons and and then the unarmed guys bring him in. I'm just yeah. I don't know how to feel until we know for a fact. Because I, I feel like we don't know for a fact. I know. So I'm saying either he is dead or he isn't yeah. dead. <laughs> exactly. You got two options, you guys. You only got two options. Right? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold out. I'm not going to cry or anything. I'll be sad until we know for a fact. Well, I know. That's why it's like, <laughs> like yeah. It's kind of so climactic. Yeah, it's climactic. Yeah, it was so sudden. Yeah. If you have gone to heaven, then we will never meet. That's what I was saying. They'll never meet again. I made the boat that will take you to your heaven. <laughs> oh, Bucky, you stop it. Apathy, by the way. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's so. <laughs> Loki. You betrayed us. I loved you more than anyone. I loved you more than that priest oh. ever loved you. But it made no oh, difference. Oh, Loki. You always thought, oh, it's just Loki. <clears throat> no need to bother about Floki. He's just a fool. Hmm. I, I hate you, Ragnar Lothbrok. Hmm. No, you don't. Fuck, you're you just hurt. My heart. Why do you tear oh, me away from you. myself? Dang. Okay, moment of truth coming up. <laughs> Are they gonna do what you said? Is he gonna be alive in there? Except you'd hope that Floki would have poked some holes in the boat. <laughs> See, like he's not even in there. It's just gonna be all weapons. Weapons, you're right. It's just all weapons. <clears throat> good guess, you're right. That's a good guess. Kind of like a Trojan horse. Yeah. 
Well, we'll see. We'll see. That's my guess. I just can't believe Ragnar's dead. Not like that. They didn't even give him like last words or a last scene. They just... Right. Well, in the way he grabbed Bjorn's hand. Like, I have a plan. Well, yeah, like... Like, I got a plan. And Bjorn was the one to tell him that he's dead. And, and, and besides, Ragnar was determined to conquer Paris. He didn't want to go down without a fight. So even if he is dead, he still want to conquer it in the afterlife, I guess. But I'm surprised, like... <laughs> see, because you think, like, Rolla or Bjorn or somebody being there with him, carrying him in, like, they're not even there. Unless they're watching him from a distance, because they know he's alive. I would say a bomb, but I don't see a bomb back then. <laughs> I don't know how they'd make one. Yeah, I don't know either. I'm yawning, not crying, you guys. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Though I did almost want to start getting straight eyed when Lagatha was talking about how she never see him again. <clears throat> For some reason, Floki's bothered me more. I think because he had more passion. More and, passion. And Lagatha was just so sweet. She was being brave and strong. But that's why we want to cry because she was just so like, honest. Like, I want to be with you again. And, and knowing that they might never be together again. I mean, I'm kind of sad. <laughs> Whereas with me, Floki, I'm just like, I understand it. But I'm like, Floki, you screwed yourself over when you killed Athelstan. <laughs> this is is killing me. I need to know if you're right or not. <laughs> Wait. What is he doing? I don't know. He's got a weapon. He got a... Yep, there were weapons in there. Take her and then demand they hand over the city to them, maybe? Yep. Well, this is okay. Then this allows her to meet Rolo or Brianna, whichever one she's gonna marry. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like hell, though. I know. Like, I know. I, ho I guess I hope Floki pokes some breathing holes in there. He did. Because I'm like, uh -huh, I don't want Ragnar to. But Floki. I wonder if Floki is part of, well I don't know who all, I guess we'll find out who all is part of the plan. Yeah. But don't you think they would have gotten across the bridge first? I don't understand, well maybe I Well I think they just needed enough of a segue to get them into the, into Paris. Oh yeah. Because the other dudes, they don't have enough men, manpower. They've lost a lot of resources trying to defend it. Yeah. But the dead will conquer Paris. Because he's almost dead, is that what they mean? Yeah. Now he's gonna die. Oh, here comes his his crew. <laughs> Crap, this actually might make me cry. <laughs> they're real goodbyes. <laughs> but they're all pissed because they said their goodbyes and he got to hear it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I will stay. No. Rollo's gonna I'll die. I'll stay. stay here, Floki. Yeah, right, I'm just still lying down. <laughs> I know, he just looks like crap. shit. <laughs> I know, he does. I mean, he's still cute, but yeah, he looks like crap. That mask is so Yeah, crazy. you might have to Google up and see what the heck that it's is all about. Wonderful. So what are we to do? Oh, you gotta marry him. <laughs> Create an alliance. Or a wife. I will have to offer them even and more. And even greater treasure. I must offer them something far more precious to me. Yep. And go. Yep. For supper. Yep, 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 yep. No surprise there. Mm. You must offer your hand in marriage. That's. I mean, Roll is rough around the edges, but he's got his soft spots. He's not into whips and chains. <laughs> The Emperor also offers the hand in marriage of his beautiful daughter, Princess Gisela. 
What must I do in the return? You will defend Paris against your brother. Mm. <laughs> Once again. <laughs> Yo, you know he's gonna take it. He's gonna want to. Because that means he'll have more power than um, Ragnar, or equal amount, if not more. Is this the wedding ceremony that we're watching right now? <laughs> I know. <laughs> Dang girl. <laughs> Dang girl. You know, well, let me eat that bad. Okay, he's pretty cute actually. <laughs> and you could do worse. You could be with Odo. I know. I think Odo would be a hundred times worse. Yeah. Besides, you know, Rolo is gonna dig like that fiery passion of hers. You know he is. J'avoue. Salut. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you like it? Girl, I'm trying to learn your language. Oh my god. You killed that those ten. Yes. That, I thought he had known that. I, guess. I know. Is he in? Oh, hunting. This show. Let me get a pause and we talk about it. <laughs> Discussion time. Woo! Okay. Yeah. Well, okay, let me just... Where do you even start? I know. Okay, so, I'll just go back. Okay, start at the beginning. We're riding our stick this whole episode. He's right. still alive. He's still alive. Not dead. Nope. And Elander, so he wants to kill him. Yes. So, we'll see if he dies. Right. Um... And, okay, well, I guess we'll just talk about Ragnar's plan. So, he obviously, that's what he must have told Bjorn when he grabbed his hand. Right. He was like, hey, <laughs> this is what we're going to do. Yeah. And you're right about the whole Trojan horse type thing. Yeah. He, they snuck him in, and that was their way of conquering Paris by capturing Gisla. Is it, I think it's, I say Gisla, but I think it's Gisla or something. Yeah, it doesn't that. matter. Um, but yeah, but it was way for them to get in and raid and <clears> take the spoil. So, technically, you got to conquer Paris. So yeah. Very happy because yes. he was determined to do so. Yes. Um, and then, yeah, and so then I think... Um, of course, everyone's pissed. They he, they weren't in on his secret. Mm. I mean, yeah, like you were saying, then they revealed all their stuff to him and he heard it all. <laughs> you know, he heard it all. <sighs> yeah, so right at the end, he said, you could Athostan. I guess for some reason I thought he... Well, how did he figure Athostan died or who killed... Cause I he, thought he already knew. I thought that's why he was mad at Floki. And yeah, I know. Like, I thought I think it. he... Maybe he suspected, but or may or maybe this wasn't or maybe what he meant by you could ask this Dan was. I like I think he I think he, Floki already knew he knew, I could be wrong, but I think what he meant by you could ask this and it wasn't a sort of I'm revealing that I know I think it's a more of, the reason why. I did this too, is because you killed Athos. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Right, because Floki like was all confused, like I love yeah. you, but I hate like, you. Like the reason and, all right. this stuff's happening is because you killed Athos. Oh yeah, because then Floki say like something about like, yeah, like being like pushed away or shut out, mm -hmm. kind of, or whatever his words were. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Like you, yeah. So I don't think it was a revelation, but more of a an Give explanation. Give them a reason why. Yeah. Gotcha. yeah, you killed Athos. Why I'm mad at you? That's why all these things have happened because you killed Athos. Right. That's my interpretation. Yeah. Okay, what's up, Rolo? Rolo, Rolo, Rolo. Okay, oh, yeah, so. Once again. Not su Once again, what? Oh, gonna guess his brother. Go guess his brother. Oh, I gotta say, I feel like this is the first time in a long time you've seen him smile. <laughs> I right know. Right at the end. I, wow, I forgot how cute Rolo was when he smiled. I know. Um, but, uh, yeah, so he was the bear all along. I mean, Bjorn could still. Well, yeah, I mean, because Bjorn, it's not that he had a many princess, it was Or, or he could still. So realistically, if, if Ragnar dies and Bjorn takes up the mantle of king, he could constantly be sailing everywhere to go to new places. And, right. You know, so there's that. So, yeah, so Rolo is the bear, assuming that they're going to get married. I hope, I kind of hope, that we get to see kind of like their weird-ass courtship, because I don't really want to see them like, because I'm assuming they do get married. Um, I hope they don't like, or he dies, <laughs> I don't know. Right. I, um, she gives a funny way to kill him, who knows. Um, I hope that they don't like jump over it too when they're already married or something. Yeah. I kind of hope we get to see like it happen. Um, because I find this kind of amusing and I kind of want to see them like grow close or something. You know, that's sort mm -hmm. of like, because she hates them so much, I kind of want to see them like grow fond of each other. <laughs> um, and, uh, well, Rolo, he learned how to say hello. 
in French. Yeah. Or whatever. That was it. <laughs> but still, he took the time to learn it. He's, yeah. He's proud of himself. I know he was. <laughs> I was like, well, it's one word. Okay, it's one <laughs> word. You're too proud of yourself. <laughs> Way too proud of yourself. After, it was funny because after she's like cutting them. Da, 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 I know. Like, hello? <laughs> I know. Because she was like, you know, I, I would not, like, I would rather die and, and yeah. all this terrible stuff happened to me than have him touch me and marry him and things like that. And I'm like, girl, you know, I, mean, I understand. I understand. It has oh, something yeah. to do with, you know, religion. And well, and plus they, they perceive them as definitely animals and dogs. And, and the fact and... that they, you know, invade other city. Right. Oh, yeah, you can't blame her one bit. Yeah, no, I definitely don't. Not um, blame her one bit. You know, she's having to marry a man, she doesn't know who he is, from a completely different culture, a completely different religion. Yeah. A completely different language. Yep. I mean, I don't blame her for not wanting to marry him. No, I don't either. Um, I don't roll, hello. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I was like... But, of course, he's up for it, because he wants to be... Powerful, yeah. Because he's always, he's always after the power, man. Yep, yep. And he's That's like, his downfall. He's always... Oh, I was yeah. after that power. And then he probably thinks, sweet, I get more power. I, you know, get a Mary, princess. Well, why a not? Duke. Become a duke. Whatever that means to him. He doesn't know what a duke is, Yeah, I don't is, know but... if you know what that means, yeah. Because, I mean, that's second after king. Yeah, I mean, he doesn't know that, but, you know. Um, Yeah, I mean, but that's, yeah, because Ragnar is still technically the king. But that's the thing. If her dad dies, then he's married to her. He'd still... Ooh, would he be considered a king? Or would he well, we don't know because we don't know what their customs are. What their customs are back in those days? Because I'm just thinking of like when I like modern day, like in England with Elizabeth and Philip, right. You know how he's not technically king and she's a he's queen. still just a duke, right? Um, so Malcolm Sorry. Richard, yeah, just a duke. <laughs> yeah, because his title of prince was just kind of honorary. Um, right. Yeah, I'm curious. Yeah, I don't know how this works back then. Um, I don't know. Well, guess, we'll find yeah, out if, we'll find if it out. even gets that far. If it even gets that far, yeah. Um, man, because Gisa, I guess I've been answering, right, she really does not like her dad, so. <laughs> That's true. So, who she knows? She does not like her dad. Yeah, so who knows? Maybe, maybe her and Rolla would become close and they can plot to, like, maybe they'd plot to kill her dad or maybe. something. Maybe. You never know. Who knows? Um, yeah, so we'll see where that relationship goes. But like I said, I, I kind of hope they get a follow-up because I, I kind of like a weird, like, Opposite love hate type stuff. So yeah, because if he's a duke, he wouldn't necessarily be crowned. No. But so if they get married. But if they get married and and he, her dad dies and she would become then queen, she could she, crown him. He would get crowned. And she could crown. She could do the crowning. Yeah. Right. That that's where I was going with that yeah, whole sorry, thing. Sorry, yeah. Yeah. Like he could marry her because right now she's a princess, and then later she could crown him. Yeah. But initially she said, "Bring me his head earlier." But obviously, if they're married, she couldn't really demand that because I'm assuming as a man in this scenario, he would have more power over her, I'm assuming. I but, don't know. But her station would still be higher than his. I don't know. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, yeah. guess we'll find out. But now I'm excited to see where that goes. Just, I don't know. Yeah, anything excited. else? Cause it's, yeah, it was just unex well, not unexpected because we... Well, here's, I was supposed to say, because we, we were banking on Bjorn for the longest time. Right. Because that's the thing, it wasn't until last episode when they said Rolo fights like a crazy bear, did we find him be like, oh shoot, it's Rolo. Before that, we were always banking on Bjorn, so in that right. regard, it was kind of surprising, but like not surprising since, you know. Okay, um, I th now oh, he, oh, the and last... now he can go dance naked on the beach. If it's good things to come, then yeah. Yeah. Well, the last thing, yeah, Count Odo, um, that one lady... I wanted to okay, so I wanted to talk about that. Um, so we took her hair like a sex dungeon or something. Yeah. Um, and now my thing is, um, well, because that's he he had made a comment about if he if he got to marry Gisela, he'd, he'd, he'd want to break her. But my thing is, um, but would he do that to her though? Being the princess, she was her husband. That's true. My thing is, though, I wanted to say, um, the kinky stuff he's into, is it like? Um, is he, I don't really know if he's into it just for the pain or if it's like pain and pleasure. You know, as a sort of like, through pain you find pleasure. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So I don't know, I don't know if he's coming from a place of, he was wanting to like, hurt the princess or this woman that he brought to the dungeon, you know? If it was, if it was just true pain or if it was a combination of yeah, pain and pleasure. Matter. You know what I mean? Because like, if, if it is what I'm thinking it is, like, you know... BDSN type stuff. Right. Then I'm assuming it would be a combination of pain and pleasure. But 
I don't really know. I don't know like what he's into. Yeah, and I don't I, know. I don't care. Um, but I just wanted to say though, I don't know if she, because she willingly stepped into it, and he did say you can always say we can stop when we want to stop. Yeah. So I don't know. I just don't know if she was in pain. <laughs> they didn't show it much. Um, so thank I mean, God. Well, but you were covering yours like maybe. But my thing is, I was like, I don't think this is torture, Mom. <laughs> I'm not. Well, lying. I don't care. To me, it's uh, statistic. Not, not if they're into it though. To me, it still is, even if they're into it. But that's, she didn't. He didn't force her into that. Uh, either neither hair is too weird for me. Anyway, doesn't matter. Move on. <laughs> okay, so clearly, you guys, my mom is like, like not into. She's super judgy. So y'all kinky people out there, be careful. Okay, she'll be judging. <laughs> She'll be like, your puck, your sexual proclivities are like weird. <laughs> no, I just don't. It's just not me. I don't really care to talk about it or think about it. So. Cool, yeah. Uh, I think that was it. Oh, and the last thing, yeah, I gotta look up what those masks, the mask. Oh, yeah. She's always wearing. I gotta look up what that means. Um, okay. Yeah. I think that was it. That was it. Yeah. Alrighty. All right. Yes, I'm, I'm definitely like, I'm definitely excited to see where the new season goes. I'm wondering if Ragnar is gonna he heal somehow. <sighs> if he's gonna die like in the first episode, I don't know. Yeah. Um, he's still alive, and um, yeah, I'm excited to see where the Rolo beast list stuff goes. Yeah. Alrighty. Excuse me. I right, so hope you guys um enjoyed that episode. If you want, again, you know, like, like I always say, the full length reactions to vote and polls, early access to videos, all that good stuff. You can go check all that out on my Patreon. I've linked in the description box and in the comment section down below. <sighs> yeah, and don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. And I think that's it. So, hope you guys have a beautiful, wonderful day. Good night.